Hey everybody, it's Taylor with Boys and Grove, and today we're gonna turn one of these into this. Because I had so much fun making that battle axe out of a saw blade, I decided to make something else out of a saw blade, so this time we're gonna make a knife. Let's get into it. Now because I'm just working with a 12 inch saw blade, that means I'm limited to how long I can make my knife. So I thought that I would rather have a longer blade and just a short tang on the end than try to make a handle or anything. Um, now I am no bladesmith or blacksmith or anything. I've never made a knife before in my life, but I've watched lots of forge and fire. I mean, I know what a tang is, so that counts, right? After a little bit of experimentation, I realized that the easiest blade to use in my angle grinder to cut these saw blades is actually a tile blade. They're really durable, you can use them multiple times, uh, and they make really smooth cuts without a lot of kickback or anything. It's really, really nice. So that's what I'm going to be using. the slot for the tang to slide through in the guard I just use a metal carving bit in my Dremel. All right, well after some shaping going back and forth from my sander to the angle grinder, I think I got it about where I want it and I actually got kind of a edge on it. The only thing that I'm really not happy with is these uh, saw teeth on the top. You know, as you can see, it just didn't turn out that good, but you know, it is what it is. And I got plenty more of saw blades to experiment on later, so. For the handle, I'm not going for anything fancy. I just got this square stock of oak in the shop, so I'm going to use a piece of that. When figuring out the shape of the handle, I realized that I had a machete that had a really nice feel on its handle, so I decided to use that as my template for the handle for this knife.
I wanted to add some color to the handle, but I didn't have any colored stain. So as a replacement, I just watered down some acrylic paint. Now that our knife is finished, all that's left to do, do is test it out. Cute knife you got there, man. Whatever, man. <laughs> hmm. All right, and our saw blade knife is completed. I really like the way this turned out. Yes, I know it is far from perfect. And like I said earlier, I am no bladesmith or blacksmith by any means. This is my first attempt at ever making one of these, but I still think it turned out pretty good for a first try. Um, the blue on the handle just pops really nice. It came out really nice, and it actually does hold a pretty good edge on it. Uh, heating up the tang to fit in the handle was a really good idea because it fed in there really snug even before I epoxied in there. It's just a really big learning curve. A lot of things that I figured out that I'll do differently next time, um, but a lot of fun. If you enjoyed this project, make sure to like it. If you want to see all our other projects, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And we would love to hear what you thought of this project in the comments below. Or if you've attempted a knife out of a saw blade, send us a picture in the comments below. We'd love to check them out. Thank you very much for watching. Be safe and have a great day. Right, now that our knife is finished, we can go That's test it out. That's not a knife. This is a knife. It's the <laughs> same knife. Yeah, okay. Really? Really? Really?